I want, I want to jump into that story, man. We met just so authentically yeah. on, on my tour and you were, you were like head of security, but you were the fun security and I got away with more stuff. <laughs> that let you. you get on the roof of the tour bus. And, yeah. But yeah. I also, um, you also got kicked off the tour for that. Yes. I, I don't know if you remember. I do remember. So <laughs> I hope you remember. Country and I meet on tour. I'm on the Roman vs. Fusi tour. Fun time. Yes. I really miss that. Um, and we're doing these shows and we just instantly kind of bond and we connect. And each time I'd walk out on that stage, it'd be like me and you were, were fist bumping and yeah. we're like, you know, go get it or we're, you know, whatever it is. And over time we become like, this is my buddy, you know, and this guy could get me in and out of these crowds. These were different crowds. This is the first time in my life I, I was in that environment that I'd see in a movie or I'd see on TV. We were packed and we we're pushing through people and mm -hmm. people are grabbing my hat, and my bags and my, you could somehow just get me in and out. And I was like, I respect this guy so much. He's good at this. But I could also go to you and be like, hey, the other security guys won't let me up on this tour bus. Do you care? And he's like, Let's go. You know, we do it and we get these awesome shots of the crowd. And, but I also remember once we hit Europe, they were like, countries, countries canned. And I remember going to Fusi and I was like, hey, we need, to, we need to put our foot down. I want country in Europe. So I got you back on the tour. Yes. Sir. But then we, we bonded uh -huh. and we became close. And at the same time, you're moving to Ohio. What did I do? And that? you didn't even know I lived in Ohio. No, I didn't. Tell, tell me about that. I would go out and I'd do my speech. You had like a story about. Yeah. Um, so I got called up and um, I'm actually in um, Vancouver working a major festival and um, I declined it. I didn't want to do the tour. And I get like numerous phone calls asking me to, to take on the tour. And I couldn't meet your first tour date where I believe, um, I want to say you was in a different location. Your second date was in New York City. And it gave me enough time to come meet you on the second day. Mm -hmm. And I remember coming to meet you, hearing your story was me on the side of the stage, hearing you talk about your family for the very first time, hearing you from Ohio. And I, you won me over of just... I couldn't get any more information on who Roman was <laughs> because you just opened up to the world. But also I'm like, it's crazy I'm moving to Ohio, but you don't know that. No. And in the process of us growing together, um, you and Brittany not only has opened up, but I also realized how important your soulmate was to you having the perfect peace of mind, whether she was going somewhere or she was doing something for you to get ready, you getting ready for meet and greets, just giving you that peace of mind that it became like not only working with you, but working with Brittany too and moving you guys around and making sure the peace of mind is happening and making sure everything's good. But um, I will honestly say what was unique about that tour was my moments were special to me was our walk because it was the first time that no matter how busy you were, we actually made the time for each other 20 minutes prior, me and you just talked about family.